gunfire near a busy shopping center in Indian River County. Our team is live in Vero Beach, where a deputy involved shooting is now under investigation. We are paying more for a lot less in the store these days. We're getting answers on if the shrinkflation trend could become permanent. But first this afternoon, crime scene tape and heavy law enforcement presence near Vero Beach. WPTV News Channel 5's Megan McRoberts is live at a Sam's Club parking lot at 50th Avenue where a deputy involved shooting is now under investigation. Megan, what can you tell us? Yeah, that's right. Still very active scene behind me. You can see here. The Indian River County Sheriff Eric Flowers says Seminole County investigators already pegged the man who was shot out here to a homicide investigation, a suspicious death investigation in their county, Seminole County at an Islamic center. If you take a look in the scene, you can see there's a blue minivan at the center of the crime scene. That's where this investigation has been centered. The Seminole, Seminole County victims stolen minivan. That is this here, according to investigators. It was captured on license plate readers headed south, prompting deputies here to follow him and pull him over in the Sam's Club parking lot. Sheriff Flowers says within about a minute of that traffic stop, the suspect started acting erratically. He opened the car door and got out speaking a foreign language. As you see here, Flowers says deputies asked to see his hands, but instead he reached into his pocket and pointed finger guns at the deputies, but they didn't shoot him then. That's when Flowers says it appeared the suspect dove into the car and in fear he might have been reaching for a weapon. Two deputies fired, at least one of them shooting the suspect three times. Flowers says they're waiting to search that van, but there were reports in Seminole County that he might have explosives. You know, you see the way that this guy is acting. I mean, he, he wanted to be shot. The way that he pulls his fingers out, points them at the deputies. Um, the idea that they didn't shoot him when he did that really is, is a great control. The fact that they didn't shoot him at that point when he dove back into the vehicle, they had no choice. I mean, he, he's just acting crazy out here, and I, I understand exactly why they did it. And Flowers says that suspect is known to the FBI. There were other people in the parking lot. No word on if anyone or no one was injured, rather, including those deputies, but they will be on paid leave, which is standard in a shooting investigation. That suspect, who we have not yet confirmed the ID, is currently undergoing surgery, according to investigators at Lawnwood. No word at this point if he is expected to survive. Reporting live in Indian River County, I'm Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5.